I love you and only you, baby. Hey, I'm ready now. Wake up, wake up, somebody's sending you back. Somebody's sending you back. Okay, I'll hit you with the simple bass. You got it? Yeah, bass guitar. I just What is up, YouTube, 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 YouTube. how y'all doing? Yeah, 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 yeah. Check it out without a doubt. Hey, um, R. Kelly interview, co-open on um, Saturday Night Live joke. <clears throat> now, is that, well, I needed to see it because I don't know what's going on. I think that um, he's supposed to play R. Kelly, right? And then that's the lady that's interviewing R. Kelly, I think. I don't know. I ain't never seen it. So Tyson Roberts asked for this one right here. Appreciate you, Tyson. Uh, Y'all hit that subscribe button, hit that bell, and let's check this bad boy out. CBS News Special. I am your host, Gail King. Okay, that's R. And Kelly. this is part three of my interview with R&B star R Robert Kelly, also known as R. <laughs> Kelly. Robert also Kelly. Also known as individual who number ones. Thank you for being here, Robert. Well, thank you for having me, and please just call me victim. Victim. I am not going to do that. I guess my first question for you, Robert, is why exactly are you doing this interview? Because... People think that I'm some kind of a monster. I, I'm here to remove all the doubt, okay? My lawyer was telling me no, but my ego, my ego was telling me yes. <laughs> Robert, please call me victim. No. <laughs> Tell me call some me of the victim. things that people are saying about you. <laughs> that I have a harem of young girls and that I started a, a, a what's the word? Starts with a Q. You mean cult? <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> Right, and why do you think people are saying that about you? Probably because it looks like I have a harem of young girls and I started a cult. Because <laughs> it I made looks a lot like of it. In my life, maybe I can't read or write or math. <laughs> but I'm still a person. I, put I can't math. <laughs> I got you. I can't read or write or math. <laughs> what I happen to do? <laughs> I made a lot of mistakes in my life. Maybe I can't read or write or math, <laughs> but I'm still a person. I put on my pants one sleeve at a time, just like everybody else. Oh my God. What about the Lifetime docu-series that interviewed nu numerous women, family members, and your former tour manager, all saying the same things? It's 10 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> and I'm talking to Oprah's friend. If I can just get through this, everybody's gonna love me again. Robert, the docu-series. All right. These people made a six-part documentary about me. Six. That's almost ten. <laughs> <laughs> and not one of them said a nice thing about me. They made it seem like I was the devil. I'm mm. not the devil. And even if I was, you can't think of one nice thing to say about the devil? <laughs> I can. Nice horns. Gives good advice. <laughs> so why do you think people are making these lies up about you? For money, obviously. I'm a very rich man. And people mm -hmm. are always trying to take advantage of me. 
Well, if you're so rich, why did it take so long to pay 160000 you owe back in child support? Damn, that's a good question. I wasn't expecting that. Now I gotta switch directions and get some sympathy back. Because I'm a very poor man. But Robert. Victim. No. You sold Victim. millions of records and made millions of dollars. More than millions, thousands. Oh my God. Millions is more than thousands, Robert. Okay, my bad. <laughs> so what happened to all the money? I don't know. <laughs> Ask my, who, who's the guy you pay to watch all your money? Accountant. Starts with a Q. Your accountant? <laughs> no, my cousin Reggie, that's it. <laughs> you know what? This is all great stuff, but maybe we should save it for some of the interview. What are you talking about? This is the interview. For real? Well, then where are the cameras? There's literally one right in front of you. Hey. See, I'll just keep y'all camera out in the open like that. <laughs> Boy, y'all some freaks. <laughs> just tell me why all those women would say the same things about you if they weren't true. You can start a rumor about a, any celebrity just like that. All you got to do is push a button on your phone and say, R. Kelly did this to me and then attach a video of me doing that thing. <laughs> and people will believe you. It's scary. <laughs> I really want to laugh right now, but I can't tell if this interview is a prank on you or a prank on me. <laughs> this interview is going great. Oprah's friend thinks I'm innocent. I should be a lawyer, Robert. Or maybe I should run for president. Stop <laughs> saying it. <laughs> oh, you can hear that? Yes. Now, oh, you can hear that. Why, why were you hanging out at McDonald's? Okay, first of all, I did not go to a McDonald's. Boy, we saw you at McDonald's. Boy! Okay, fine, I love McDonald's. <laughs> it's my favorite restaurant in the world. They got that burger that I like. What's it called? Starts with a Q. <laughs> Big Macs? Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Look. Quarter I'm pounders. I'm just gonna ask you plainly. Have you ever held women against their will? Why would I do that? That would be stupid. How stupid would it be for me, R. Kelly, with all the crazy legal things that I've done in my past, on tape, and gotten away with, <laughs> scot-free, to do it again? How stupid do you think I am? Is this the camera? Th no. <laughs> That's the plan. Okay, guys, think for a minute. Use your brains. Why would I do these things? For 30 years, I gave y'all trapped in the closet, <coughs> feeling on your booty. Robert. Age ain't nothing but a number Robert. and so many other clues. <laughs> <laughs> this is how you repaid me. And so I many other clues. 30 years. Hey, brother, okay, brother, okay. Oh, man, okay. that's almost a decade. Who the hell is this? <laughs> oh, this is my crisis manager. Right. How am I doing? Oh, boy, you killing it right now, Kels. Who you looking real good out here? Yeah, do I look sympathetic? Yeah, yeah, especially when you screamed at that at that lady, man. Real classy. Mm -hmm. That's real classy. <laughs> spit, spit, real quick. Okay. <laughs> now we're coming down the home stretch. All right. Okay. So, uh, crisis <laughs> averted. All right. <laughs> okay. I am ready to start the interview. <laughs> the interview is over. Oh, Robert, you've been combative. <laughs> defensive and completely unhinged but somehow you expect us to believe you are completely innocent that would be ideal yes <laughs> and now i humbly await your decision miss jail king what my name is gail king with a g jail so king you're not the jail king <laughs> then what i'm doing here <laughs> boy you are not right so you think i made things worse yes you definitely made them worse scale of one to ten how much worse 13. <laughs> so is that the highest? All right, fine. I guess there's only thing, one thing left to say there, J.L. King. Live from you know New what? York! It's, <laughs> it's over, fool. Oh. Right here. <laughs> Live from New York! It's Saturday night! <laughs> he, he turned to the plant. Live from New York! Fool, the camera <laughs> That boy.
Golly, R. Kelly, man. That I'm glad of that. I ain't playing. Don't request no R. Kelly songs because we not playing no R. Kelly stuff on here. I still like R. Kelly. Make great music. No, he he does make great music, but that part right there, I can't hear his music no more because of the stupidity he done did. So that's just my opinion. Y'all listen to it if y'all want, but I know for a fact his sales and everything that went down. Not because of me, but because people like me, me and the rest of the team. I'm going to get on up out of here, man. Y'all shout out to um all those girls that was victims and everything, man. Y'all um, pray for them and keep their head up. Hey, I'm going to get on up out of here. Y'all take a light, take a slow. Tell them, Mike Cross. Told you so. Peace out.